Hi, welcome to Kavis Plants and Orchids. You are seeing my Kalanchuri plants in bloom. This is a normal variety, not the hybrid one. I have kept in a stand. I will show you the stand in which it is kept. So, now it has started blooming. The hybrid varieties have now started yet blooming. The first here in uh, the winter has not set in much so the kalanchoe needs uh, drop in temperature for blooming so it, because of that you are seeing it is the summer only buds and uh, some are flower see it's very beautiful actually yesterday night it rained because of that the flowers have bent because of the water in it you could see the water which is sitting in it actually i keep them outside only not where they get rain also now that they it needs very good sunlight for flowering i have kept in a place where it gets good sunlight so this is the flowering period of kalanchoe so i'll give you the care details once uh, before the winter sets in you should fertilize them and even between the flowering season also you should fertilize them i give vermicompost only now i am not having any cow dung otherwise i used to give cow dung also very beautiful flowers so since it is a succulent type of plant it is better to give uh, organic fertilizer not the chemical fertilizer I don't give any chemical fertilizer also even the leaves are very beautiful even without the flower I'll show you the top one even though all are of the same variety see the sides of the leaves are reddish in color maybe it sits on the first uh, this thing of the stand so it gets more sunlight i don't know maybe the reason because the other ones are this also has a little bit this doesn't have any of that reddish big nice reddish color so the fertilization is just before starting of the winter you could fertilize and in between also after it started flowering also you can give because it may need more energy to give good flower and uh, term it needs even though it is a winter flowering plant it likes to have sunlight so keep the plant where it gets good sunlight only then it will flower nicely the winter sun it likes if you don't if it uh, see this is the front portion of the stand I will show you the back side. See the back side, the flowers are not there much. You see. So, there it, the, even the plant is facing towards the sun. So, that is why I said it needs more sunlight. Watering, it is a succulent plant. So, watering you have to be very careful don't water too much even yesterday's rain it happened night otherwise this is not a rainy season so that is why the whole whole rain fall on it so uh, otherwise it is better to keep them away from rain but usually in the winter season you won't get rain here where i live but this time i don't know everything is not like the previous years so it rained the propagation is you can just cut a stem of this or you can just take a leaf a from leaf also you can propagate and then you can make new new I see from one plant I have made this many plants this uh, this, this stem is so big the old plant actually that is why the water fell so 
propagation I told. Very beautiful plant. And it is very easy to grow also. Doesn't have, only thing you have to be very careful is about watering them. And the potting soil has to be very porous with a lot of sand and perlite and less of garden soil if it is very sticky. In my case, our garden soil is very sticky, so I use more of sand and perlite in my potting mixture. Even see here, new buds are coming. This is how the whole stand looks. Um, actually, the hybrid varieties are kept in another stand. It has not yet started blooming. Hope you like the video about Helen Choi plants. If you like the video, press the like button. If you are a new person, first time to visit my channel, consider subscribing. Thank you for watching.